What makes Henderson a great destination for foodies? You can go have dinner anywhere, but I, I truly believe that we are creating dining experiences in Henderson. Something that's really fun is that we serve just really fun and funky flavors with our coffee. We make all the syrups in-house and a lot of the things that the syrups are made with, we actually grow ourselves. We got a DM on Instagram of just lists of the local farmers in the area that we've been able to connect with. Little by little, uh, we uh, doing a lot of food. Uh, we brought uh, many different chefs here to teach uh, our team the to bring uh, something else. So our theme is that we try to mix farmer and Frenchman with everything. So we embrace the ag agricultural background, of course the scenery behind us, local products from our own garden and from surrounding farms and things. Whenever people come out here to dine with us, they get to have a local product, but they may have a chef from I mean, Lyon, France, who's, um, who's creating the dish for us. Barbecue is a passion of mine, my family, my father. The name Homer is my great-grandfather's name. I wanted to live that legacy through Homer, and, and that's where the name Homer's Barbecue came from. And we love really connecting with our customers on a daily basis. And coffee just brings people together in a way that we want to be a part of. Our baseline is just very different from what you can expect from other cafes. I think the more that Antler has developed, I just hope it continues to be a creative space for people. We've got a lot of great restaurants. They all complement each other very, very well. Treating people with respect, treating people as guests, and giving them the opportunity to have a great time is what we're looking for.